Astros hosting the White Sox, and the White Sox are plus 143 on the money line. The Astros are minus 170. The over-under is 8.5 runs. The White Sox getting a run and a half on the run line are minus 135, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you'd win, or if they only lose by one, you would win. The Astros laying a run and a half are plus 115, meaning if you bet them that way, they have to win this game by two. Now, these are the overnight odds. They're going to change the closer we get to first pitch tomorrow. Use a site like VegasInsider.com. It is totally free and it'll allow you to compare all the casinos' pricings in one place, whether you bet online or in person. And then use a website like Covers.com, another totally free site, and it'll let you compare every gambling stat there is known to man. It'll also let you get the player stats individually, like for pitchers, strikeouts, for hitters, how many hits they average in a game. And the longer this season goes on, the better this tool actually is. Now, Clevenger did not pitch against the Astros last year. This is his first appearance as a White Sox. He was a Padre last year. Garcia pitched once against the White Sox last year, and the Astros were 1-0 in his one game that he pitched. He went five innings, three runs, three earned, and that was the game that they beat the White Sox 21-5 in Chicago. Now, head-to-head, the home team is 6-4. The home team is on a two-game winning streak. The Astros are on a two-game winning streak. The Astros are 6-4 and four in their last 10 against the White Sox. The favorite is 6-4 and four on the money line. The underdog getting a run and a half on the run line is 6-4. and four. There have been four one-run games in their last 10 meetings, uh, one in their last four, and a, a few in their last, like, six. The over has hit in their last two games. The over-under is 4-4-2, four, four, and two, and the under 8.5 runs is is 6-4 in their last 10. The game they played today, the Astros beat the White Sox 6-4. They beat them 6-3 yesterday, and then the White Sox beat them 3-2 on opening day. I don't like this matchup for Clevenger. I think the Astros pitching staff is a little bit deeper, and yeah, they're still at home. I think I don't know how badly they embarrass the White Sox, or at least in my opinion, but I think they win, and I probably going to say this game goes over. I'm going to take the Astros with the money line. I'm going to take the Astros laying the runs, and I'm going to go over in this game because I think the Astros are going to get to Clevenger early. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.